You lost it at the end there, James. You glad it wasn't a Super League game. <laughs> It, Dave, you have to go through that sometimes. I think it was one of the easiest catch that Barry Flynn's had all game. And then we got lost a little bit. We've changed our wing. We've lost a couple. Of, and it wasn't anything, no injuries. It's just a bit of tightness. The pitch, the pitch bogged us down a little bit in the second half. And our down probably felt the same. That we just got to start getting a little bit tight backs and some tight hamstrings. So we made some changes with outside backs. But, you know, overall, I'd say we came in half time. Got changed the team a lot. We were in a real strong position. I felt then that Tom and Danny Craven and Grant Gore did an exceptional job pushing the team around and we played very, very well. And it just got in the arm wrestle and then got the lead back. And it was a okay, it was a good game. It was a good hit out for us and hopefully touch wood we've come through okay. Like I say just some tightness. That's about getting ready for the big one, eh? Right. Okay, then. I, we'll find it early, yeah, we'll find out next week. He just type extend his elbow a little bit, so it was just again it's one of those when you see it out there, as soon as somebody grabs something or holds something is we're not trying to make them any tougher, we know they're already tough. So if they've got something where they get tied up, we just need to get them off the field. So that's pre-season gives you that opportunity to be able to change your team around and try and keep everybody as fresh as you can. And we've the idea of our pre-season games away from home and against some real tough opposition like St Helens and Cass is that we wanted to be uncomfortable here. We've got a lot of players in the small changing rooms. It's been really wet over here. The pitch is a bit claggy. We're not used to that on any we've done. So the start of the year is going to be tough. We've got some wet games, some big environments. We just wanted to be mentally tough in the way that we prepared for these games. Happy with Dudson's first contribution, then? Yeah, solid. So he knows he's got lots of work and it's just like he's He's not really done a lot for pre-season, he's not really been highly involved with Wigan and what they were doing and he's had a three weeks with us and that's his first real big challenge was today. But hit the line okay, fell on his front, bent his back in defence, so yeah, it's, just need to blow those cobwebs off and you don't do that without just getting out there and getting a bit dirty. Uh, I was happy with him today. I'm really happy with him and old Carroll as well, he's, that's his first pre-season hit out and looks like a We've got a new front row in him, and I said he played a lot last year, so we've really pleased him. It was a bit cruel on Paddy Flynn, really, wasn't it? Because he had a fine game for you again here at Cass. That's the breaks, isn't it? It's one of those. That's Paddy's job, isn't it? He's got to catch that ball. And it, if it was above his head and four or five people hanging around, he probably catches it easier. <laughs> but he's got to catch that ball. But he's been he's played exceptionally well in all pre-season games. He's, he's been outstanding. He made some really good decisions. He made a couple of poor decisions defensively, but. When we change the centre over and we change the path back over, it's you just put people under a bit of stress and that was good to see how they responded to that and again go back to the point where we got back on we got back in the arm so we made it tough for each other and we just each side was hunting that mistake. And when we got it we just wasn't smart enough and clinical enough to get any points on the board, but Castle probably feel the same way as me.